Well, this fire required a massive response. We had hazmat teams from both the Phoenix and Tempe fire departments on scene. I just heard an explosion and that came out and the semis were all on fire. The explosions John Frank heard were caught on camera. Came out. I came right here. And that was the flames were above the building. Sky high flames and thick black smoke. And all the commotion from the fire trucks and the smoke. When I got here, it was like 545. There's a lot of smoke in the air, a lot of smoke around the area. Kind of hard to see, kind of hard to breathe. Phoenix Fire says when crews arrived at the Nicola headquarters, four electric semis were burning. What they call is thermal runaway. So these cells that are packed in these batteries, they contain a lot of energy in a small amount of space. So extinguishing these are very difficult. But we're, what we're doing right now is that we're cooling these trucks down and preventing extension to more, uh, more of these vehicles. The first obstacle firefighters faced was keeping the fire from reigniting. The second Second, the dangerous chemicals burning off the batteries in those trucks. When I first seen the, the fire truck back there squirting the hose, probably 200 feet from the fire, he wasn't wearing anything. And then last, next time I checked, came out and looked, he was wearing a mask. He had a suit on it. Well, Phoenix Fire tells us as a precaution, the headquarters here were evacuated while firefighters battled that blaze. Anita Roman, Fox 10 News.